RP days, one of the most ingenious devices in our scheme of defense is the predictor. It looks like a movie camera, and these diagrams give some idea of how it works. The Vickers predictor is electrically connected to several guns, as the drawing shows. With the height and speed of modern planes, the old firing method simply won't do, because by the time the shell arrives, the target is gone. So now you have to calculate the future position of a moving target. In other words, you have to anticipate it. And in these calculations, you mustn't forget the shell's curve or trajectory. Combined, they give what is called the quadrant elevation. The gun must point here when the target is actually here. An electric cable with a small voltage connects the predictor to the guns and now see what happens. The speed of the wind and its direction are indicated on a dial and every move from now on is telegraphed, so to speak, to each gun. Getting a line on the target is just a matter of seconds. One observer follows the target horizontally through a prism telescope on one side, and the second man does the elevating or tilting through a similar telescope on the other side. This action makes two pointers revolve at the back, and from them the final calculation is made. On the front of the predictor are two drums on which a graph records the position of the target. The men follow the lines on the drums, one setting the time and fuse and the other the elevation. He gets his height from a separate rangefinder, and the predictor does the rest. The gunners simply match the pointers on the dials. The automatic fuse setter saves many valuable seconds. And before you can say knife, a well-directed gun is barking out a protest. Thanks to the predictor, the visitor is in for a hot time. <laughs>